Oh, it's a bass. It's a bass. Oh, on a small jig. Help her, help her, help her. Give me her pole. Give me she just got on her very first crappie. Alright guys, so I just switched up to a bandito bug, Texas rig. I'm gonna start flipping. Well, I think we figured out a pattern here, which is a Texas rig. God damn. I think he got biggest fish of the day. Alright guys, so I just switched up to a bandito bug, Texas rig. I'm gonna start flipping. I didn't get any bites on chatterbait. Or the A rig, so I'm just gonna start flipping this bandito bug around in the structure because I think they're gonna be holding up in the structure. So, what do you wanna do? First thing you wanna do? Yeah, everyone on the same side of the boat's not a good idea. <laughs> First thing you wanna do is put your finger on the line like that, alright? And then you hold it, open the bell, and then when you throw it, it's gonna be like throwing a football. So, I tell everyone. So, you know how when you throw a football, you let go, like at a certain point? So it's gonna be the same thing. You're gonna wanna let go with your finger on the line. Like watch, as soon as you go like that, you just wanna let go with your finger on the line. Let it go. Let it sink for like, count to like three seconds. And then you just wanna start reeling it like kinda like this. You're just gonna do like that. Oh, I just got bit right there. Oh, they're definitely pecking it. I just got bit on two casts right there. Here. I should have tied a frog. I use 50 pound braid. I brought him right up over that log. Yeah. Bandito bug, does it work? Does it work? <laughs> like that? The first one you invited, yeah. right? The first bass, yeah. There he is. I flipped way back and past that stick, bro. Brought him right up over here. Oh, that is giant. I'm waiting for you to pull up a slab crappie. You want to catch more crappie throwing that minnow, but that white's been working, so. Oh, no, nice one. I just had one. Oh my god. Oh look. You knew I had something. You ate your leg. Yeah, bluegill look. OG. He ate one of the legs off. Well, not big, but felt big. Does it work? I'm a two on the bandito, bro. Does it work? Yeah, 
soon as I switch to flipping, two pounder, look at his tail. Loosen your drag, loosen your drag, tighten it a little bit, but just make sure your drag's not too tight. Don't let him jump. Try not to let him jump. Shit. Take your time, take your time, take your time. You got him, you got him. Is that on the uh, Senko? Oh, on that long one? Slim shake? All right, take your time, take your time, take your time, take your time. Yes, I am, take your time. Don't horse him. I'm not, I'm not even moving the pole. Okay, I'm just letting you know. It's about ready. Oh yeah, oh shit. Ah. Oh yeah, that's a tank for this lake. Look at that. Woo! Look at that slim shake in his throat. I don't have a scale. I ordered one. Don't have one either. Got the hook out, guys. This is probably a four and a half. This is a big bass for this lake. A different type of strand of bass. They don't really get too big. But I think we figured out a pattern here, which is Texas rig. God damn. I think he got biggest fish of the day. I say he's four and a half. Easy. Guys, I ordered a scale, but it's not gonna be here till tomorrow. I was trying to get it for today, but it didn't come in time. Actually, it's gonna be here today at nine. He's good. Uh-oh. He's not ready. There he goes. I caught two. Bass? Yeah. Well, Probably like 15, 20. A lot. We can't get this bass to revive, dude. Really? Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with him. Huh? Dude, oh my god. None? Huh? None? We're at 29. I'll give you a tip. Start flip. St start. I need to give you the tips. We're at 29. Boy. No, you're not. Get ass. Shut up. I swear on my mama. What? Look at those lily pads, G. Tie on the frog. <laughs> you can with that 65 pound bait. I'm going chatterbait. Bro, I threw the chatterbait all morning. <laughs> Didn't even get a bite. I literally threw it all morning. No bite. This is going to be a good bluegill territory, too. Nice, nice G. Nice G. Keep pressure, keep pressure. Just keep horsing them through it. Got it. You want me to help you? Here, hold this bit. Oh, that's okay. Nice. Oh, shit. Oh. Yes. Mm. oh, on that chatterbait. I was just telling him. You ain't gonna get nothing on that chatterbait. I was like, you ain't gonna get nothing on that chatterbait. <laughs> Woo! Look at that. That's a five. 
yeah. That's close to five. Yeah, that's, that's a lunker. Look at that. Hold on, Woo! Ah, uh, the grind paid off, right? Mm, finally. The one bass, the one bass to bite, dude. Got it. Cha Ching. Hey, all right, get them back. They're just back here living in this stuff. It's hot. He got me good. He took me way in the tree. <laughs> I think they're bluegill, dude. They keep pecking it like that because a bass would take it. There's no way. Wait, watch this. Was that not calling it? Yeah. Oh, it's pulling too. Uh, decent. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. Oh yeah, he's a pretty good one. Oh yeah, it's a pretty good one. <laughs> I'm like, oh, he's peeing. I'm like, he's decent. There he is, guys, on the Wackums again. See you later, buddy. I literally called that, right? I knew it had to be a bluegill. There's no freaking way. That's a dink spotty color. It's a, a mini split Wacom bait. That brown natural color. See if we can't get them on that. I haven't caught one on it yet. I've just been throwing that green, mostly. Is there a crappie here? Um, I have crappie minnows. Oh, dude, he ate it right at the surface. Oh, I've had one jump out of the water for it. On that Wackums. Yes, sir. Stupid. Stupid. All this bait right here. Damn, he just came up top water for that minnow. Yeah, fast that guy is. Holy moly. Yeah, gorgeous. Doubled up. Isaac caught like a four and a half on a chatterbait. Really? Yeah, in the corner over there. Be careful. Put your rod tip down. Fighting hard for a blue, yeah. Sure it's not a big crappie. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god. Look at the size of that one. It's gotta be the biggest one all day. Damn, she yoked it. Where's the pliers? <laughs> when you feel them bite, you gotta set the hook. I didn't feel them bite, I was just reeling up again. God damn, this is the biggest one of the day. Look at that one. Isaac. That's how we were catching them. One at, bro, this is literally the size we were catching last time. Every one of them. Well, my SD card was full, but changed it and uh, she got on another bass on the Wacom Bay. On that, she's been throwing that white all day. Killing it. He's a nice little one pounder, two pounder or so. Nice, man. Alright, let's get him back. Right down here in the smorgasbord of gigantic roaches. I know, I see him.
we go. to eat it it's a nice one there he is look at that one yeah he's a healthy one Oh, got a bass. Yeah. He hit it on the fall. Yes, sir. There you go. He hit it on the way down. Wait, hold up. There we go. There he is. How deep? That's a two pounder. <laughs> I was like, wait, that's not a bluegill. I tightened my drag. <laughs> We're on the top of the mount, too. Look at that. Bro, he wasn't going nowhere. He was hooked so good. Second, third nice bass for me of the day. That's probably my biggest one. My other ones wasn't that big, I don't think. Nice one. Purchase your tracks today.